Tony, after a, a massive effort at Chelsea, it was a big ask to come here on, on Saturday and, and do the same again. Yeah, we, we were disappointed. We looked flat, we looked empty, and, and we looked in a, you know, like I say, in a, in, we played really well away from home at times this year, but we didn't look anywhere near it today. And, um, I'm, you know, you've got to give Southampton a lot of credit. Southampton were the better team and looked very dangerous, you know, long up front, you know, run us at times um, all over the place. Um, and we needed a leg up, and, and you know Craig's convinced in the first half that it's a penalty for us. Um, I'll have to look at it and see whether it was, but the lads are saying that he's actually touched the ball and then the players played him. Um, and we didn't even get that, so you know that that summed our day up really. It just wasn't our day. Picked up another injury with uh, with Darren Fletcher yeah. as well, which uh, on top of James Morrison, not what we need. Now James has ruptured his hamstring, so he's out for six to eight weeks, um, and Fletcher's opened his knee. So, you know, those two have, the last few weeks, um, have played really well in the, in the positions that you would want to put them. You know, Fletch loves to run around and Yak compensates with that and Morrison's got that quality just in behind. It'll keep the ball and play those passes through that will give forwards opportunities and chances and obviously combines that with scoring some goals. So those two uh, will be big misses for us. It's one of those days you have to put behind you and start again on Tuesday. It'd be interesting to see the other results, you know, the other teams who have played their second game away from home as well. So many wins, you know, that there are in the league, and you know, if, if they've achieved that, then fine. It must probably down to us in, in that respect. But it'd be interesting to see across the board after a really busy and hectic Christmas, um, how many teams have played their second away game in three or four days and have actually got something out of the game.